Hey there, people. Well, do you guys remember the hoarder I met uh, two weeks ago? Well, I stopped by his house yesterday, and he's got some more stuff for me there. So we're going to go check that out. And uh, he got smart this time, though. He wants a cut. So he goes, I'll split it 50-50 with you. So let's go see what he's got. Hey, Morris. Better late than never, never eh, buddy? What's that? Better late than never. Yeah. What do you got there? Oh. Video camera. You could use a tail light, eh? I know. <laughs> oh, the horde's getting smaller and smaller for him. Getting there. It's got quite the pile. Might be a two load, eh? What's that? It might be two loads. Shape it up that way. Yeah. I didn't realize that pile was that big. Oh well, we got all the time in the world, eh? I have, I'm retired, I don't know about you. I'm retired also, my man. Is that right? Here, we'll call that a load for sure. It's got lots of copper and stuff. Does it look safe, Morris? Does it look safe? Yeah? Good to go? That's some old shit there. My new buddy Morris can't get in the truck. He's got to go get something to uh, step on. He's coming with me to the, make sure I don't rip him off, I guess. He's a cool old guy. Okay, let's go cash this shit in. Dropped off my new best friend Morris. He's happy what we got today. Uh, what did he bring in? 120 bucks. He wanted to give me half. I just said, oh, just give me 40 bucks and we're good. Because he got a lot of more stuff to, to take out of there. You should see the stuff he has. It's just it's a nightmare, man. What a hoarder. It's nasty. Well, he wants to pay me to clean inside his house. You should see that. Wow. Anyway, we'll see about that. But uh, yeah, he's a good dude overall. Like. Anyway, I got back in time here. I can do another scrap run, so we'll do shift number two. Okay, let's hit the road. Talking about hoarding. Hmm. I think I'm becoming a hoarder again. I gotta get rid of some of this shit. Oh my, what a mess. I picked all this up. Uh, well, the bike frames, the chairs, the barbecue, the sink. Just down the street from me on my way back from uh, Maurice's house. Or Morris. Morris the hoarder. Okay, let's go. Well, the prices of metal are down again. 170 bucks a ton. Just last week they were at uh, 205. Well, I wanted to touch base on uh, my buddy Morris again. Uh, the reason he's getting rid of his hoard. He doesn't want to get rid of it. Like, you should see how sad he gets. Like, he was all sad getting rid of that shit we had. But anyway, the city stepped in. They friggin' took his dog away from him. They took his dog away from him. Because his yard's too messy. Never mind that. Like I said, you should see inside of his house. Well, I gotta go back there tomorrow, so I'll <laughs> pull out the camera again. But anyway, for now, let's go scrapping. through that little pile right there. That's all I want is that little pile. Come on, help a brother out. Well, if it wasn't for my sister and her husband, I would have never got anything tonight. So thanks, Laura and Dennis, appreciate it. Oh, don't look at the mess again. Okay, let's go in and have a beer. Well, that was an interesting day. Well, cheers. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you at Morris's house tomorrow. <laughs>